Well, 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 look who came crawling on back to YouTube. Me. I'm sorry. Cut. I'm not even sure if I know if who I know who I am anymore. Well guys, it's been a while since I posted, but I'm back and I apologize. It's always a little bit tough for me to get back into the flow and into the swing of things when I take a little break and I come back. So well, not so many goofs and gaffs today. We're gonna take a dive into a pre-order that I made months ago that I forgot all about, um, which happens to me all the time. But it showed up today and I was kind of curious um, to see how it looked with you guys. Um, by opening this box. I haven't, I've only seen this on Trick or Treat Studios website. This is their new, I believe it's new. It was a pre-order, so it is Trick or Treat Studios 2022 uh, Leatherface mask from the remake that came out. I think it was just called Texas Chainsaw um, on Netflix. Now, I remember I really liked that movie. It seems like I'm very much an outlier in that regard. Um, it did not review well with most people. I remember really liking it. Uh, I'm a fan, I stand by it. I gotta rewatch it to see if I still feel that way. I, I haven't seen it in probably since it came out. But I have the mask today here to unbox with you guys. So I figured we would do it together because um, I don't know. I've only, like I said, I've only seen the pictures online. Now there was a uh, Spirit Halloween version of this mask, which I'm not sure if that was by uh, Spirit because they do have their own original masks and stuff or if it was by Trick or Treat Studios for Spirit Halloween. I'll put that um, image up on the screen. Uh, that I saw that after I pre-ordered this and I kind of wish I waited <laughs> um, because that mask looked much nicer. Um, it had the hair and I think it had more of a actual mask to it. This one is I believe just the front part of the face, we'll see. I'm kind of curious how those look. I believe that's sold out now, but um, we'll kind of compare, even though I only have the picture to compare the other one to. Let's open this up. Make sure I hide all my personal information so you can't come and kidnap me in my sleep. Oh, it's right there. Look at that. Wow, that's it. <laughs> I guess there's not much to protect. Wow, this is way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. That's that's what she said. Said. Oh, no, 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 not that. <laughs> Just come on, you guys, let's do it. Here we go. So that's it, guys. Uh, <laughs> uh, let me see if I can back up a little bit. This is actually really cool. I'm not upset, with, I'm not like, you know, I, I was just saying now the other one looked a little bit nicer with the hair and stuff, but I actually like this a lot. Let me take a second. A little peck. Okay, uh, yeah, so you got, um, you got a strap on the back, <laughs> a strap on. So you can um, wear it, because that was one thing I was concerned about. I'm like, how how does this, um, you know, how do you actually wear this thing? It does have an ear missing here, which I don't remember if that was part of the mask in the movie. It must have been. We have this little thing here. Just this, this has some care instructions. Doesn't say much else. I do like all the details. Um, really, you know, I mean, it's really well done. It's uh, Trick or Treat Studios. They always do good work. Uh, here's the bottom. Sorry, I'm moving it all around. It's kind of not in frame, but I'm trying my best to get as much of the detail as I can for you. I like it. I really think it's cool. Um, do I wish it had the hair? Maybe, because as you can see, I don't. So I want to put this on, of course. It's a little big, but Leatherface is a big guy. Although it fits pretty well. It 
kind of is digging into my nose a bit. <laughs> How am I supposed to wear this? Like this? This is like digging into my nose. But then if I wear it like this, it's kind of... It doesn't taste very good. You know, do, see, if I wear it like this, then I can do the... Ah. Yo, who fucks with Texas? No one fucks with Texas, bitch. It kind of hurts my face a little bit. I want to go to like a rave with this thing. Crowd killer. All right, well, that's enough of that. Yeah, I mean, overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I think it was like 40 bucks. Uh. 40 bucks, you can't really go wrong. I'm gonna put it up on the shelf. It's gonna go with the rest of my chainsaw masks and, uh, yeah. Oh wait, I always wanted to do this. Yeah. Cool. Check that off my bucket list. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. If you pick this up, let me know what you think. If you got the Spirit Halloween version, definitely let me know um, your uh, your thoughts because, um, like I said, I think that one sold out, and uh, I was pretty curious about um, about that one. So. Anyway, I'll talk to you soon, guys. I appreciate all the videos. I appreciate your patience, and um, I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye, guys. Massive thank you to my Patreon supporters. If you would like to support this channel, you can find those links in the description. Bye bye.